Today's question for flat earthers is, can they explain the Canigou effect? These are the Canigou mountains between France and Spain. And the, they are about 1.7 miles high. And the interesting thing about these mountains is, one evening in February and one evening in October, they are visible from Marseille, which is about 160 miles away. Now, this shouldn't be possible, even if you're standing at a thousand feet altitude and you're over 155 miles away or nearly 160 miles away, 1.7 miles should be hidden, so you wouldn't be able to see those mountains at all. So um, this shouldn't be visible. This is a picture from Metabunk, I think, and it shows how the sun is uh, setting below the horizon and you can see the Kanegu mountains uh, appear. Now this is the reason for flat earthers to say well if you can see the uh, Kanegu mountains from over 160 miles the world can't be a globe it must be flat. Well I have some issues with that. Um, if this wouldn't be possible on a globe how would it be possible on a flat plane? Um, how does the sun set below these mountains? They explain how the sun would set uh, below the horizon due to convergence lines. Um, but if the sun is at 3000 miles high, how does it set below these mountains to actually see these uh, mountains appear? How does the light bend from a flat over a flat earth to make these mountains visible. The other thing is, why is this only visible twice a year? It should be visible for more days in February and more days in October if this is a flat plane. Um, you can't see this more than twice a year. Um, from a closer range, uh, like this position near Montpellier, which is 109 miles away, you can see these mountains every day of the year. This is because this is only 109 miles. 1.4 miles would be hidden, so the top uh, 0.3 miles of the mountains would be visible. So it wouldn't be a problem from there. Only from Marseille, this is visible for two days in a year. How is this possible? How does um, this work over a flat plane? I would like to know, and if you're a flat earther, explain this to me in the comments. Thanks for watching.